skin and I used the milk milk this is today's makeup of the day my base today I am wearing the L'Oreal infallible 24-hour fresh wear foundation in a powder I did use my Smashbox primer water because you guys know it's major bay and then my smashbox setting spray I, I love anything smashbox for the complexion i think it works really well for my skin. and i did use the milk makeup hydro grip um, primer and then so for the rest of my face my eyes i'm wearing my fenty primer again i'm trying it out i've been really liking it i think it works really well and then for my bronzer today i pulled out my kiko this one is their magical holiday matte powder and i have this in a darker shade so this is caramel and i think it works really well in just bronzing my face and then for my blush today i pulled out my cover effects monochromatic blush duo this one is in warm honey i think it's really pretty i just dab a little bit this is very very pigmented if i want a little bit of luminosity i dip into the shimmery one it's not shimmery it's not glitter it's just kind of like it has a nice sheen to it which i have a lot of acne scarring on my cheeks so i avoid anything like shimmery on my cheeks because like when it like dips into my acne scars it like emphasizes it but this doesn't do that as it just kind of like floats in the top it's a really nice sheen and I really like so today I'm wearing the Ulta Beauty ultra slim brow pencil I'm trying to rotate out all the stuff that I own so I can use it in a different makeup of the day it's really nice no complaint I like the color this one is in dark brown and then to set my eyebrows I'm using my NYX control freak eyebrow pencil and I know NYX has a lot of new things coming out right now and I know they have like an eyebrow glue but this is like the OG and I think this works really well in just kind of making sure to brush out my eyebrows and to make sure they stay in place and I think it works really well so I have yet to venture out and grab the new stuff that next came out so so meanwhile I have that and it still works really good and then if you want like a quick eyebrow highlighter that's so easy to blend this is my favorite this is from benefit this is highbrow this is an oldie but a goodie but it works so well i've tried different other brands that have make these like brow highlighters but the benefit one it just melts into the skin it just goes glides on the brows you can just use your fingers to blend it out i think it works so well. my eyes today i am going through the stuff that i bought for the holidays and this is one of them it's the nyx diamonds and ice please eyeshadow palette and and I decided to play this is have like lilacs and blues diamonds and ice anyway so I used the lilac shade on this palette for today's look I really like how this turned out so not bad not complaining really and then for to complete the entire look I am just wearing my lifter gloss um, so this is a little bit mauve -y. this one is in silk very very shiny if you haven't checked the lifter glosses from 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 Maybelline they're really nice I highly recommend them so that's what's on my lips so if you want to see how everything came together from start to finish stay tuned for the rest of the video thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you on my next makeup of the day bye Can I tell you a secret? Might have to slide in close for you to hear it. Over that bartender, yelling out them drinks. Will the cover band off key sings? Yeah. Can I tell you a secret? Between you and me, all I can think about is leaving here early to get you alone. Close down this place, yeah But I'd rather close up this space